Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Queen is worried about son Prince Andrew's future in the royal household. The queen is reportedly scratching her head over Prince Andrew's fate in the royal family. The Duke of York, who was banished after his involvement in sexually assaulting Virginia Jiffer and ties with sex trafficker Jeffrey Epstein, is looking to regain his respect in the eyes of Britons. The Sun on Sunday revealed that the 96-year-old called Prince Andrew for intense talks, a source said. He has had discussions with the Queen about what he can do with his life. But there are also wider family discussions, the source added. Earlier, royal commentator Richard Fitzwilliams noted that the father of two is keen on getting center position in the monarchy. He told Express.co.uk, Andrew is in the background, though he is trying to arrange a comeback and it is getting him nowhere. He has to accept that at 62, he has no future public role. The royal family have to create one for him, such as managing the royal estates. Prince Andrew has expressed hope Queen Elizabeth can influence future King Prince Charles and Prince William, who see no way back for him. According to reports by British media, Andrew spent three days locked in intense talks with Mother Queen about his future in the royal family. However, Oak reported Prince Charles and his elder son Prince William see no way back for Prince Andrew following Virginia Jeffrey scandal. The Duke of York was stripped of all his patronages and military titles following a multi-million deal with his abuse accuser Jeffrey earlier this year. The Herald Sun, quoting The Sun, reported Prince Andrew spent several days alone with the Queen at Balmoral, and the mother-son duo were locked in intense talks about his future in royal family. The report citing a source says, he, Prince Andrew, knows he let his mother down badly, but he hasn't been convicted of a crime. He wants to try to establish a route back. He's hoping the Queen can influence Prince Charles and Prince William, who see no way back for him. So what do you think, guys? Please share your thoughts in the comments. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more interesting news about royal family. Thank you.